I'm excited to announce that we have an A2O resource page on our website at acservicetech.com. So if you want to know the differences between R32 and R454B compared to, say, R410A and R22, make sure to check out some of these videos we have here. We've got also charging scenarios. We've got the dissipation board, so leak sensors. We've got a updated refrigerant weight calculator, a PT chart. We've got some of the tools used uh, for A2O refrigerants and where they say they're certified or compatible and explaining all that and kind of c covering some of the myths that are being uh, portrayed out there in the industry. So we're going over bubble and do because R454B is a azeotropic refrigerant. And so it's different when you're comparing the saturated temperature on the vapor side compared to the liquid side. So we've also got some resources from Ty Branham in there. And so the differences in R32 compressors versus R454B and R410A. We also go over some of the uh, changes that the manufacturers are making uh, to basically increase the amount of refrigerant in the factory charge length to include about 30 feet worth of line set. And so Ty goes over some of that and what the differences are in the mixtures of these new refrigerants. So if you want to learn more, head over to acservicetech.com in the resource tab and click on the A2L resource page.